coming off our bye week, uh, gave our players and coaches a chance to kind of regroup a little bit, uh, re-energize ourselves and get a little bit of rest. Uh, we were able to keep a few guys off the practice field the first week, and, and I think that helped uh, getting some of those uh, bumps and bruises taken care of. So uh, we go into this week, uh, we've got a very tough game down at Gustavus. Uh, they are the uh, leading offensive team in the conference right now, uh, especially throwing the football. Their quarterback, Mitch Hendricks, has had a great uh, uh, first half of the season, and uh, they've got three really talented receivers, uh, very solid offensive line. So. We know we're going to be in for a battle. It's going to be up to our defense to go out there and, uh, number one, put pressure on, on the quarterback and also make sure that we're covering their, their pass routes. But um, I think we're up to the challenge. Uh, we've been uh, looking good on, on uh, defensive practice, and I think our guys are looking forward to it. Offensively, um, you know, we got to keep, keep improving, keep uh, keeping the balance in our offense a little bit. Uh, we threw the football a little bit better the last game against Hammond, although not a lot. Um, and uh, But we've been working on it in practice, and we think that uh, if need be, we can go out there and throw the football. So uh, we'll establish the run again, hopefully, like we have in the other games, and then um, you know build on that throughout the game. But it should be a great game. Um, Gustavus is 6-0. and They um, have a lot of great things going for them. Uh, we think we're a good football team, so it's going to be a battle between two very good teams, and uh, we hope to see everybody down in St. Peter. St. John's University is coming off a bye week. Um, uh, before that, we had hosted Hamlin and got a win there, which is, was great. That seems like a long time ago, though, as we've had two weeks now to prepare for a very important MIAC matchup with Gustavus Adolphus uh, this, this Saturday down in St. Peter. Uh, they're off to a pretty good start, 6-0. Uh, and all putting up a lot of points and, and yards uh, from the offensive side of it. But um, with the extra week we've had, we've been able to get guys healthy, uh, kind of rest up a little bit, and hopefully we uh, are preparing uh, for a very talented offensive team that has three or four guys that catch the football very well, and they spread out the, the, the catches to just about everybody and fairly a decent running attack. Their quarterback is, is leading, uh, I think, the conference in – and passing and touchdowns and all those kind of things. So uh, we got we got some things we need to do. Obviously, we got to get a good rush on the quarterback, and we have to make sure that uh, there's not too many yards after catches and guys do complete passes. Uh, that certainly is the nature of the game, but uh, we just can't give up too many yards after catch. And if we can do those, do those kind of things, uh, I think we'll be in good shape to get our offense the football and come away with a win down at Gustavus this coming Saturday. Having the bye week was nice. Uh, we get a chance to, uh, you know, rest, recoup a little bit, rejuvenate, and uh, hit hit into our second half of the season. So, from that standpoint, we get a few extra practices to prepare for Gustavus. But really, we worry about ourselves and um, what we can get better at. So, um, coming into Gustavus, we look for a, you know, obviously a, an intense game. They're a very good team. They've traditionally given us a lot of trouble defense. Their, their defense, they run a four three, um, sometimes a four four defense, and and it's quite a bit different than what we're used to seeing um, this, so far this year anyway. So that alone, uh, um, it, it was nice to have two weeks to prepare for. Um, but again, uh, um, I'm sure they run their defense a little better than our scout guys. So it'll be a challenge. Um, we hope to you know, kind of continue on what we've been doing, uh, running the ball well, passing when we get, get an opportunity, and, and putting points on the board. I think we've been doing a great job in the red zone. That was a priority of ours. And, uh, we're uh, scoring uh, close to 90% of the time, I believe, in the red zone, which is a positive, and, and uh, we hope to continue that this weekend. All right, well, it's nice to be back here after the bye week. Uh, a lot of guys got rested up. Uh, nice for a lot of guys to go home and get off of school for a bit. Um, big week this week, uh, coming back, uh, practicing Monday, Tuesday, and now Wednesday here, preparing for Gustavus. Uh, lots on the line here. They're 6-0. and uh, Mitch Hendricks has definitely uh, proven himself as a legitimate threat uh, in the conference, and we know that it's going to be a big game for us uh, a conference title game, that's, that's how we're approaching this game. Uh, and also some redemption from last year. It was a, um, a pretty bitter loss that we had there last year. But uh, we're healthy, we're ready to go, and it's going to be a, a good game come Saturday.